I started going to the Y when the kids were all really little. They've grown up there. Jonathan's grown up at the Y. And um, when starting from when he was a toddler and he used to go into the child like play area. And um, it was always like a really safe place. Like I've always felt really comfortable, like drop my kids off and feel like I can have a little bit of time for myself. And knowing that they were having fun and doing something positive. He um, was doing different sports and stuff at the school. Decided he wanted to try swim and uh, really took off with it. And then after Jonathan's accident, he was uh, in the hospital after his accident for about four months. That time it wasn't safe to get him in the water. As he progressed and um, was getting better, I really wanted to get him into the water. And the Y had the open doors policy and that um, enabled us to be able to do uh, and go to the Y and participate in, um, in activities that we wouldn't have been able to do. Being in the water was just something that he could still do like after his accident and like just move so much more natural and feel comfortable, I think. Um, actually, there is a one lady, um, hopefully it's okay to give out her name, Tanya. Um, she, um, her and her husband are part of the Virgin Club and um, they wanted to help out and they were asking for a while, hey, what can we do to help out? And I said, well, actually, we're always looking for volunteers to get in the pool and help in the pool. So she started coming and um, just volunteering her time in the pool after her water exercise class. It just really was nice to be able to have a safe place to come back to and kind of continue with that process, like not feel like it was still a safe place to come and grow and work on the things that we needed to work on. And I mean, when he first started, he um, really wasn't able to stand at all. He really wasn't able to move the left side at all. And I think the, the water allows him to move in a way that he can't. He feels like the water is his element and that's his safe place, his happy place. He said, always go 100%. <laughs> yeah, Johnny 100, that's his motto and he has it on his, um, his support bracelets. Um, the 100 freestyle swim was his race. And so it just kind of became, Johnny 100 became like, you know, it was it was his race, but it became his motto of giving 100 percent and uh, always trying to kind of do one more, give one more, go the extra mile. The world like is just there's so much stress like outside, but you come in the Y and it feels like you can be yourself and you can work on the things you need to work on. And it's a good place to grow and make mistakes and learn. Well, I just, I mean, honestly, the why, like, has meant so, I mean, I'm going to cry. Why has meant so much to us? Anything we can do to, to help or give back because um, they've really given so much to us. So.